What's up guys? My name is CJ, and for those that don't know me, I run a mixing and mastering studio specifically for metal bands. So if you like metal mixing tips, uh, if you like content that's specifically catered towards metal bands and people that tune low, then check out the link in my bio. Uh, that'll take you to all my social media accounts where I do short form content, or it'll take you to my YouTube account where I do long form content. Today, I'm gonna talk about tempo changes in Reaper. I recently had a client ask me to do a little tutorial on that. So this one's for you, Sam. So first things first, guys, you're gonna to wanna to go to view and open up the tempo envelope. Now this is gonna give you this blue line attached to your master track. If you can't see your master track, you wanna to go to view, click on master track. Anyway, here's your tempo. Let's say the project is at 100 BPM and you need to slow down to a slower BPM. You're gonna right click and insert a point, or you could also shift click a point in and we're gonna drag this down to let's say 77 BPM. You wanna right click this point and set your shape. Instead of square, we want linear, and that way it's a nice gradual change down to your 77 BPM. Now let's go back to that tempo envelope before we made changes to it so I can show you an alternate method. So firstly, let's go over here to insert, tempo time signature change marker, and let's say 100 is the BPM of our song, but we wanna gradually transition the tempo to our next marker. So we're gonna click OK there. And then we're going to place a new marker by going up here to insert, tempo, time signature change again, but we wanna go down to 50. And we're gonna untick this box and click OK. And that is going to give us our gradual transition and everything is in time. Now you may have noticed as well that when you go to insert, you also have a time signature button. So if you need to switch over to 3-4 or to 5-4 or whatever it is that you're doing, it's that simple. Boom, the grid has changed. Now if you're like programming drums or programming MIDI of any kind, everything will be divided into threes.